place for us, you know, at Life and Links, where the Strictly Tour continues tonight. How has it been going? Because somebody wins every night, Tyler, don't they? Yeah, I, I don't really know what that feels like at the moment, Lorraine. Oh. Uh, I haven't won so far, so I uh, can't relate, to be fair. It's a shame, but you will, don't worry, there's plenty of time, plenty of time. So what's it been like then? Uh, do you know what? It's been the most phenomenal experience. What? There's 31 shows up and down the UK. We finished in Glasgow on the 13th of Feb. Um, seven of us absolutely dancing our hearts out. There's myself, Ellen Skelton, Hamza Yassine, Ellie Simmons, Flirt East, uh, Molly Rainford, Will Meller. Honestly, we're living our best. Our, our best four lives are going off right now. It sounds fantastic. Let's have a look at what it's like on the road. This is the Strictly Come Dancing Live Tour. This is my my people. Well, you know, it's not about winning. You know, it's it's about about winning. Stuff, I managed to get us exclusive behind the scenes access to the Strictly Come Dancing Live Tour. Let's go see how everyone's preparing for the big match. So welcome to Backstage. This is the quick change area. This is where every single one of us will be for our show. And I believe my dance partner, Diane. Hello. Jeez. She's already getting her costumes ready. This costume here about is about 5kg, but it is well worth the 5kg yeah. because it is so beautiful. Strictly in a Probably costume. Probably one of my favorite costumes to date, like ever. Tyler and I actually get married every single night on tour. <laughs> Who is most likely to trip up on stage? It's actually you, I think. Can I say you? It's literally, it's only happened twice. I've got size 12 jazz shoes on. Yeah. So I'm currently with my great friends over here, the Strictly 2022 champions. It's Hamza and Yavita. Woo! I've heard that. Every single time. What's it feel like to you It's great, man. Do you know what's good about me? When you do the Strictly show, it's like bubble so you don't get to see anybody and then all of a sudden you come out and you see all these people have been watching you and supporting you so it's yeah it's great you're loving it we have ellie over here getting her braces <laughs> 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 a wig don't you ellie yeah i do i do so this is about what i got looking like we like to switch up the looks every night we're going full green today who's most likely uh to fart on stage carlos 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 <laughs> smashing it every arena you go out you like honestly you're delivering you're delivering this is Jeanette she goes out and she goes oh we're missing one thing really three two one the judges <laughs> dancing as well you know i know they do a little bit of a shake and a shimmer in the show but they actually do like proper proper number listen to say that i get to dance with shirley ballas every single night is a dream come true for me to be fair like, i see i see craig in a completely different life as well to be fair i know because you've got to know them all i mean it must be obviously you're spending so much time together it must be really good though to, to spend that time i mean what do you do what do you do right after the show? Because you'll all be like excited and want to go out. I mean, I mean, this is it. We're on such like an adrenaline rush. We're on such a high, and then um, every. I mean, the vibes on tour. Tour life is is everything. You're living your best pop star life. <laughs> um, 
Um, so I don't know. I mean, I don't actually think I've left this left this bar since like a little, eleven hours ago. To be fair, um, it, it, it was a fragile night, Lorraine. I can't lie to you. Um, but it is. You get to see everybody in such a different light, and everybody comes together. Everybody goes out on the road. They put on a spectacular show. And arena spectacular. I really, honestly, don't know anything that compares to that feeling of going out there and, and the crowd going wild and being able to put on these amazing dances that we did for so long on the show. Um, so it really is bringing the show to life and putting it on for thousands and thousands of people, which is such a beautiful feeling, man. It's just, I'm just watching it there and it's just great. It's exactly what everybody needs right now. You know, we're coming to the, almost to the end of January. It's not been a great old time for so many people. And if you just go see this and leave your, leave your worries at the door and just go and wallow in all the fantasticness. Also got to get people dancing as well, Tyler, because so many people have taken up dancing because of the show. Yeah, that's it. I mean, everybody, that's, that's the number one question I get asked, like, coming off of the show. They're like, are you going to keep up dancing? And, it's like, coming on the tour, I'm like, oh, thank goodness I've got the tour, like, to be able to continue, you know, the exercise, the movement. I feel like that's going to be my goal for 2023, just to keep on doing it. I'll be doing a Charleston everywhere I go. You see me in the shopping centre, I'll be doing a Charleston down the street. That's it. <laughs> I think, do you know, wouldn't the world be a better place if everybody just did the Charleston all the time? <laughs> it would be terrific. It really would. Now, look, you haven't won yet because I didn't realise that everybody won at the end of the show. No. You haven't won yet. It's only a matter of time for that to happen. But how competitive are you all? Well, you're going, oh, well done, well done. That's all great stuff. I've, but are you competitive? I mean, to be fair, it's like, I, at the start of the tour, I thought, you know what? It's all a group thing. It's all right, we're in this together, which is just the taking part that counts. But actually, when we get out there every night, everybody gives a life story as to why they deserve to lift the glitter ball. I just want a little taste of it. To be honest with you, Lorraine, like I, ju I literally just want to be able to lift it one one night. Maybe it might be at London O2 Arena, it might be in Glasgow, it might be in Newcastle. I don't know. Wherever it is, me and Diane, we're literally we're destined to lift that glitter ball. So um, yeah, we go out there, we give our all. Everybody's pretty competitive. I say, you know, he Helen's up there. Will Will goes out and gives a good story. Will gives a great story when he gets out there on that stage. Um, actually, he tells the lift there. So whoever picks up their phone, and the audience get to text there live in the arena. That's which is that's amazing. That's Listen, I'll tell everybody in Glasgow, everybody that I know in Glasgow that goes alone has got to vote for you or they'll be trouble because you deserve it. I bet you're in the best exactly. shape of your life. You, oh, must, you must be in great shape though. I mean, if you're doing that every single night, you know, rehearsing and doing that, you, you'll be buff, I think is the word. You, I mean, I mean, you would think, yeah, <laughs> I, I, I was hoping I was going to be buff, but then um, I found the cake and custard in the catering. <laughs> and uh, let's just say that, yeah, that's that's cool. <laughs> My oh. sweet tooth goes off, so I don't really fit in my trousers every night. <laughs> Tyler, it's a joy. It always is to talk to you. Have a great show tonight. And you will win that British ball. You're very godmother. You will, definitely. Thanks, Lorraine. Thank you. Uh -huh. Right. <laughs>